Hello, hello, welcome to the RTYI VLN64 performance test. We are currently sitting at a comfy 61 FPS, which is 60 with the measuring error. But once I turn the camera, we are at 46. Still very good for an N64 game. Uh, I want to mention, since I reworked the entire engine, I was also able to add more detail to the old levels and the FPS on the old levels is like doubled, right? I think this is the most expensive view. It's above 30 FPS and that is perfect. If you hit 31 FPS, that is a lot more computationally wise than 30 because of the way that buffering works. That means we are easily able to render the whole game at full speed, like no issue at all so far. Now, I don't know what the most expensive view is. I would expect the most expensive view is like being up here and looking down with the mirror. It's like, oh shit, that's like 25 was the worst one we just got. But like you need to specifically set up the most expensive view and it's five FPS down from the target, six FPS down from the target. You know what? I think that is fine. We don't have to rework the whole level for that. Plus there are the swoops here which are still original Mario 64 objects. Original Mario 64 objects are kind of atrocious in the way they are rendered. So I might just have to rework them and then I think we can hit those 30 FPS. I also want to see how much this area here renders now because this area is really fun and it's like amazing looking. Oh, okay. The camera was a bit weird at the start. That's because I reworked so many things. I'm guessing camera in old areas is just fucked now. But the area is uh, very pretty looking. Very atmospheric. This level in general on the N64 I think looks a lot better than it does on emulator. Because the N64 generally renders it darker. Let's not spawn the star. I don't want to waste the time in the cutscene. The Yoshi boat there should probably also get shadows. Yeah, Mario doesn't get the lights in this level anymore because of the Matrix deck reworks. But that is going to be added later, so that is not to worry about. Let's go to the Ice Cap Palace as well. Or actually, let's go to the Mario World Palace, because that is a lot more expensive to render. Again, camera at the boot is very bad, but those are minor issues to fix later. 60 FPS does not matter if I have the camera. And not 60, 44. Perfect. No issue at all. Now I secretly hope. Oh, okay. Well, I think we tested enough. And there are some minor details that I still need to work out. Like this one, I can see from the crash screen here that this was a crash with the sound engine. One game sound, I think. From the numbers here it is the mouse the mouse like hitting the crystals is not playing properly i'm gonna fix it and uh, i hope you guys learned something bye bye